Hello guys, so welcome back. Now before I start this actual video of what we're about to talk about. No computer, my computer is being fixed because the power supply socket uh, has got a loose connection. So that's why it keeps turning, us, uh, turning, it, turning itself off and turning on again. So I can't do nothing, sadly. But I'm gonna have to wait or I'm gonna have to YouTube from a YouTube live from my mobile to watch NFL San Francisco 49s against the Rams because I still haven't seen it, but I want you guys to be there as well. So I'm gonna try and find a way to do it quick and as possible as I can to show you guys, but that's about it. So let's get into the video. So, welcome guys. Uh, after that introduction, here we are once again. Breaking news that came out yesterday. Just, I, um, I didn't do a full uh, breaking news yesterday because I wanted to make sure this was all good, it's authentic, it was the right. You know, it's come out right, it wasn't rumours, but it's true. Yesterday, Jeff Wilson Jr. was traded to the Dolphins for a fifth round pick. My reaction to it, how dopey are we? Seriously, how thick and how desperate are we? That's so much respect on that guy's name for a fifth round pick, it's disgusting. Not even a third, not even a second, not even a first. You know what I mean? It's, it's a joke. McCaffrey, first, second and third and fifth. I thought that was mental. Because this guy is come off from, from an injury, straight back in. We've traded him and he's done well so far. What does that mean for us? Jeff Wilson Jr. has now been traded for a fifth. Not even a third, a fifth. Is that how much, is that how really he's worth? Is that how bad we are? I mean, is he worth a, like, is his name worth a fifth round? Now, a lot of people could argue and, you know, a lot of people could say, yeah, but it weren't that good to start off with, but he got, he built up better than, but it don't matter, that's the whole point. And he started like that and he's just gone up like that, perfectly. So if Christian McCaffrey gets injured and no word of a lie, I will put my hand on my heart, which I'm doing now, he's going to get injured at some point. That's a fact. That's a fact, regardless how healthy this guy is from an injury. Who's the next in line? Eli Mitchell, for how long? Debo Samuel, for how long? These guys have had multiple injuries. Jeff Wilson Jr. was great. He was great. Because if you can't fall on him, you can fall on him. If you can't fall on him, you can fall on him. If you can't fall on him, you can fall on him. That's the whole point. That's why you need so much running backs. If we're the running game team, we need running backs. He was it. And they traded him. For a first round pick, I would have been fine. For a second round pick, oh yeah, okay, be fine. Third round pick, ugh, okay, it's good enough, fine. Top three. He's a fifth round pick. It's disgusting. We've got really good running backs. He was one of them. And they let him off. It's It's... The baddest trade I've seen, and desperate. It, it, it sounds like more than being desperate. I mean, all the other running backs have got injured. But this guy, injury or not, he's there. He was it. The Dolphins must be laughing at us. Really laughing at us. To be joined back with Mike McDaniel. He must be laughing for a fifth round pick. He must be laughing. That team itself must be laughing. Raheem Mostert. Is that, mate, that's going to be a great offensive weapon. A perfect offensive weapon. That, that's a perfect offensive weapon. We're on five and three now. Perfect. They could do wonders. Easy. Really easy. To lose a guy who likes that, who breaks down tackles, pressure on other people, on a defence from the opposite team. He breaks the people down. He breaks down the tackles. He can move you up as close as you can. I'm not saying 
McCaffrey can't, because he can. But then if, if he goes on an injured or something happens to him, you, who else is going to be it? Debo Samuel from a hamstring, in, uh, a hamstring injury. Well, that's a 50-50 call. It's a big concern and a big, big worry. That's my reaction to it. Stupid. Disgusting. And it's immoral. They shouldn't have let him go. But there you go. Why? Ugh. Listen, leave your comments. I want to hear you, the people, the 49ers fans, the 49ers people, male and female, youngsters. Good or bad trade? And why that desperate? Leave your comments. Tell me what you think. Guys, thank you very much, uh, thank you very much as well. 500 subscribers. I'm really fortunate and appreciate you guys subscribed. And if you're new, subscribe. Look at my previous streams. I do online streams and 49ers news as much as I can to keep you updated. Um, hopefully my computer will be back within two weeks, they said. I'm hoping. But this weekend I will do a live stream for my mobile and I'll put it on my tablet to watch San Francisco 49ers take on the Rams because I still haven't seen it and I want you guys to see my play and play call and to hear the commentary from them. Guys, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you guys on my next video.